High Performance Liquid Chromatography, or HPLC. HPLC is a highly versatile technique that separates components of a liquid mixture based on their different interactions with a stationary phase. HPLC is an adaptation of column chromatography. In column chromatography, a column is packed with microscale beads called the stationary phase. This video will introduce the basics of the operation of HPLC by demonstrating the caffeine standard injection and study the efficiency of column HPLC. The HPLC instrumentation consists of a series of simple components. First, the mobile phase, held in solvent reservoirs, is pumped through the system by one or more pumps at a constant flow rate. The sample is injected into the mobile phase stream by the sample injector. The sample, diluted by the mobile phase, is then delivered to the HPLC column, where the components of the sample are separated. The components are then analyzed by the detector, and either saved in fractions for later use or transferred to a waste bottle. The HPLC column is the key component to the system. It is composed of a metal or plastic cylinder, packed with microscale beads of stationary phase, or chromatography resin. The sample flows through the packed particle band at a constant flow rate and it interacts with the stationary phase. The compounds interact with the stationary phase differently, and therefore travels down the length of the column to the detector at a different rate. The time required for a component to exit the column, or elude, is called the retention time. The result is a plot of retention time versus intensity, or a chromatogram. The retention time is used to identify the component. The peak size, specifically the area under the peak, is used to quantify the amount of the compound in the initial solution. The choice of stationary phase depends on the properties of the components in the sample mixture. The most commonly used stationary phase is silica beads, as they are an inert nonpolar material that forms microscale beads, and achieves sufficient packing density. The most common type of HPLC is reversed phase chromatography, which utilizes a hydrophobic stationary phase, typically silica beads with C18 chains bonded to the bead surface. The components are eluted in order of decreasing polarity. The mobile phase used in reversed phase chromatography is typically a mixture of water and an organic solvent, such as acetonitrile. Depending on the sample, the mobile phase can remain a constant ratio of water and organic solvent, known as an isocratic mode. First, to prepare the mobile phase, add 200 ml of methanol to 200 ml of purified deionized water. Filter the mobile phase through a 0.45 meters membrane filter under vacuum to degas the solution and remove solids that could plug the column. It is important to degas the solution, as bubbles can cause voids in the stationary phase, or work their way to the detector cell and cause instability in measurements. Prepare a stock solution by dissolving 10 mg to 100 water for injection. After degassing, draw approximately 1 ml of solution into a plastic syringe. Next, attach a filter tip to the syringe and push the solution through the filter into a glass vial, in order to remove any solid particulates.
Then, set up the mobile phase and waste containers. Ensure that the waste lines are fed into a waste container. Ensure that the inlet mobile phase line is fed into the mobile phase container. Next, manually inject the solution, by placing the injector handle in the load position. Slowly inject the 20L of solution through the septum port. Finally, record the resulting chromatograms, 